my name is BX. BX stands for Benson Xavier. I work with the online, uh, Mavuno Online Church. And uh, one of the things that I have appreciated about Simama is uh, the, the idea of looking into a family tree, um, seeing the, both the blessings and the negative patterns um, in my, my family. And how that has impacted my life is that uh, uh, knowing the negative patterns, I know how to pray for myself and to pray for, for my son. The awareness of what is in my family really informs how I run my family, how I do marriage and how I do parenting. Uh, my own family, uh, family tree has, uh, <coughs> has uh, patterns, uh, for example, of alcoholism, and even struggling or failed marriages. And so those are the things that I said, they end with me. Um, I, want, I want to have a happy, lasting marriage, and I want to bring up my son well, uh, to be a model husband for him and a model father for him, so that generations after me uh, are able to write a different story. So that uh, the family tree, uh, when it reaches me, it shifts, it changes, we have different patterns. I've also identified blessings in my family tree and those, those blessings I, I pray that uh, they follow me and they follow generations after me. Having done Simama a number of times, I uh, took the opportunity to invite uh, the people that I work with in the online church, people who are behind the scenes, the people who deal with the cameras, uh, people who do with, uh, deal with social media, uh, sound people, they have been uh, helping us to uh, enjoy this product, this experience of Simama. Uh, but it will be unfair for them to bring it to us, to make it available um, for us to enjoy, but f uh, it will be unfair for them to miss out. Um, and so as someone who is facilitating um, Simama, um, I thought that the, my first, uh, my low-hanging apple um, was not my family, uh, uh, my nuclear family or my extended family. The low-hanging apple for me was uh, the people who I work with. We are now going into week six uh, of Simama and it has been uh, a time of uh, great conversation. But it, is, it has also given me an opportunity to serve the people who, who I lead. Uh, this is an opportunity for me to know them better, to know their stories, uh, to know how to pray for them, to know how to um, interact, relate with them, uh, know their hopes, know their struggles, know their dreams. Um, and just for us to be a, a good family uh, with relationships outside of work. I like the vulnerability in our sharing. We open up uh, to share the stories, the difficult stories, the dark stories of our families. We are able to bring them uh, into the conversation. Uh, we are able to empathize with one another, to pray for one another, encourage one another. We are able to, um, to even, you know, advise uh, one another uh, through the different challenges that we are experiencing. For me, the low moment has been uh, the fact that not everybody made it, uh, that some of the people in the production team were not able to uh, participate. This platform is, uh, is, a, is a truly a platform for healing and a platform for, for freedom and a platform of, uh, of better relationships, better relationships with your family and better relationship with friends. For someone who has done Simama, um, I want to challenge you to consider, um, you know, taking other people through Simama, uh, be, becoming a facilitator. The least that we can do is to be a blessing, to be a channel of blessing. So facilitate, uh, consider facilitating Simama.